Okay, so in this video tutorial, I want to show you guys how to type a fraction on your graphing calculator. So basically, there's two different ways you can type a fraction on your calculator. And I'm going to go over both ways and you guys decide which way you guys can you guys want to use, okay? So let's grab your calculators out and here's my calculator here and of course we have to turn it on so let's turn it on and let's get started so fractions in math fractions in math um, what's fraction? fraction is actually a um, divide, dividing two numbers that's pretty much fraction so for example 1 over 2 is the same thing as saying 1 divided by 2 right? and 1 divided by 2 is a 1 over 2 that's how we write it and of course that is 0.5 so that's one way to type a fraction so let's say you wanted to do something like 1 half times 1 fourth or something like that you would have to put okay so you would have to put two different fractions and add to each other right so what I would recommend you is that you should put parentheses around the fraction because sometimes if you don't print if you don't put parentheses the calculator will um, do use the PEMDAS and I hope you guys know what's PEMDAS right uh, parentheses multiplication and then uh, mul no parentheses exponents multiplication and division addition subtraction so that's how calculators solve problems in order of that PEMDAS so that's why the parentheses comes in very important role here so let's type in parentheses parentheses is right above your number 8 keypad and that's to open up your parentheses so just click that and type 1 divide by 2 representing 1 over 2 okay and make sure you close the parentheses too and closing is right on top of your 9 on your keypad so click that and then we got the first part done but I wanted to add a 1 fourth so hit plus and uh, open up parentheses and what would you do yes 1 divided by 4 right and close parentheses so here if you look on the left you will see we have a 1 over 2 plus 1 over 4 even though it's all in one line it's actually treating that as a fraction so let's see the answer and we have a 0 0.75 which is 0 0.5 plus 0 0.25 right so this is a one way to type a fraction on your calculator but because it's all in one line if you were to do a lot of fractions and add all of them it gets kind of like tricky because there's a lot of numbers listing on the side and it doesn't look like fractions so you lose track of where you are at so what I would recommend you is that you can use this thing called uh, fraction tool here on calculator and this is how you access it so first click alpha on your calculator alpha is that green button right so click that and then if you look on top so go up to two buttons on top and you'll see y equals right and on top of y equals what green button do you see you see F1 right because we clicked green button we're gonna be accessing that F1 not blue or the white one okay so just hit alpha and once you do that you'll see A on the screen and if you do that click Y equals and if you do that um, you will see several tabs here so number one is N slash D and second one is UN slash D. 
uh, you don't have to worry about three and four right now so just worry about the first one and the second one but the first one is a uh, non-simplified fraction so for example um, okay so just highlight number one by using keypad and it should be highlighted highlight the first one by default so if you do that um, just hit enter then guess what there's a fraction thing pops up so let's say I wanted to do something like 1 over 2 all I have to do is type 1 in the first box and then by clicking your arrow key go down and if you if you hit the bottom a uh, down button you'll go down to denominator and you can type 2 in there and once you finish your cursor is where still in the denominator right so what you can do is you can move it to the right by clicking the right arrow then now you're out of the pr out of the fraction so um, hit enter and that's one half so uh, let's go back to that F1 again and um, so by I mean by not simplify fraction is that numerator can be greater than denominator I'm pretty sure you guys have seen those problems for example um, 3 over 2 notice the fractions numerator is larger than the denominator so once you type that um, or by using the first option you can use these kind of fractions okay okay but what about the second one oh. so go back to F1 here and this right here is a simplified fraction so if we click that and notice you'll be able to type the number in the front so for example um, 3 over 2 is same thing as saying 1 and 1 over 2 right so instead of saying 3 over 2 you can also do this way so by doing that just hit enter and it shows you that it's same thing as the previous one so this tool here comes very handy because let's say you had lots of fractions like you remember how I said listing them on one line with using division sign gets kind of tricky if you do that a lot or many times but if you're using this fraction tool here it's so much better to see so for example 1 over 2 plus um, 1 over 3 oops typed the wrong one here yeah so 1 over 3 and that gives me 5 over 6 okay so that's how you type fractions on your calculator so remember there's a two different ways right so one way will be putting parentheses and by using division sign inside of parentheses and the other way is by accessing that F1 key right there so by using F1 key you can actually see little mini fractions so it's your choice I'm I really encourage you guys to try it out on your calculator to get used to it and just use whatever the way you guys feel more comfortable with okay and thanks for watching if you guys have any questions just leave those questions on the comment below and please subscribe for more uh, tutorials thanks